just like an airport. Oh look, that is the type of bus I was on. And now this is the type of bus I am on. Luxury baby. sleeper bus going from Da Nang to Nyang uh, Ving on the return journey but I have upgraded and selected a different sleeper bus to see the difference so the one I had before was 300,000 which was 10 pounds this one is 500,000 which is about 17 or 18 pounds and it is a huge upgrade. Wow, as soon as I walked in, the air conditioning was so much better. You've got these funky little luminous lights and the actual cabin as such is so much more spacious. If I, oh, go back a bit further. The other bus, my feet was touching the end, but now, sorry, my ugly feet there is at least another half or a foot so I think you'd be comfortable if you were six foot or above in this type of um, limousine bus it is wider as well on the other bus I could only just about fit like the width but now there's space there's even space for this, like, this sausage kind of thing this is here to uh, for you to cuddle I think when, you, when you're sleeping but it comes with water with all these little funky options look right LCD what is that sure sleep oh look at that so you can turn your light off and then you're on sleep mode look at this that's so cool man and this bus has a toilet unlike the other one and check out these blinds didn't have blinds before complete privacy what a way to travel to nearly 200 miles so the bus leaves at half past nine and arrives in uh, Ving Yang at half past five in the morning so for 17 pounds you've got yourself a little capsule type sleeping area and you're also traveling at the same time you're saving money on hotels whilst traveling and then you're end you're at your end destination while she's sleeping it's it's fantastic i am feeling a lot better today i was really sick the first leg here so immediately after leaving i can feel that the bus is more stable, it's not as rickety and doesn't sway side to side like the other bus, so maybe that's why I was sick. So yeah, I do really think so far, granted it's only five minutes into the journey, that is well worth paying an extra six pounds or so for more comfort especially to have a toilet as well but this is this is great this is this is fantastic i'm going to show you what the cabin looks like in a minute and also the walk area to get to the sleeping areas is wider than the other bus and i was instantly hit with cool air conditioning which is so much better so you can either be on the first floor or the second floor. I went for the first floor because I don't want to climb up and down from the bed. Even though most of the time you are lying down anyway. But it is complete privacy. Ah, another thing, you've got a hook, a hook over there. So you can put your bags... Oh, 
more comfortable because of this seat. So hopefully this is going to be a really comfortable 10 hour journey, just under 10 hours. So look, you got your USB, headphones, you've even got a call button, just like an airport. Oh look, that is the type of bus. I was on and <laughs> now this is the target bus. I am on luxury <laughs> baby Here, 5 a.m. I woke up. First driver woke us, woke me up. Thankfully, I had an alarm on. But we arrived like two minutes before I expected. But here we go, back in me.